It's happened again. Hard to believe, but true. Look at that. A jar of money meant for the family of a seven-year-old girl killed in a shooting, stolen from a store in the Woodland Acres area. This marks the second time someone has stolen a jar intended for Haiti Rivas Villanueva's family. Yeah, this one really has us shaking our heads tonight. Investigators say there was at least $500 in that jar. And over the weekend, we showed you this video from the La Tapatia store on the west side. Police saying that Tammy Cruz was in that video and that she stole the jar of money there and was later arrested. Well, tonight, another stolen jar at the La Raza Mexican store on North Arlington Road near Atlantic Boulevard. And that's where News for Jacks reporter Scott Johnson just arrived at the store and he's joining us live. Scott? Kent, I just spoke with the owner of the store who is frankly ticked off. He used a different word. He's not happy. He says it happened in here uh, early uh, mid-afternoon on Sunday. Let's put this video up because we can't show you enough because police are looking for the guy in it. The man walks in the video, looks around for a little while, and then eventually swipes the jar, which was meant for the fundraiser for Haiti's family. Walks out of the store with it. The owner tells me he's seen this guy come in a few times, never had a problem with him before, and then all of a sudden he's in stealing this jar of money meant for the family of a seven-year-old who was killed not too many days ago. He is not happy about it. He immediately called police, turned the surveillance video over to them. He's hoping they recognize this guy because he says he's seen him before. He's never really had problems in 14 years owning this store, but he says he can't believe this one. He thinks there was probably more than $500 in here. I asked, you know, are you going to do another fundraiser? He says he's not sure. He wants to talk to Haiti's family to determine whether or not that's the right way to go, but he is not happy to know this guy walks in, swipes the jar of money, and walks out. As we know, the one on the west side at the other restaurant, the woman told police she used it to help support a crack cocaine addiction. We can only speculate the reason this time around. We are live in Arlington. Scott Johnson, Channel 4, The Local Station.